Hi folks, I'm just going to do a quick demonstration of um, Google Earth and Google Maps for a browser. Um, start off with Google Earth, load that up. It's actually fairly quick to load. Um, you know, there's no waiting time really. The animation is quite smooth as you can see. Okay. So I'm just going to basically uh, try and find my house. I'm going to the UK, obviously. Okay, so I know I can go along this road. <laughs> okay. Okay, it's quite smooth, it's responsive, there's not much lag or anything like that. There we go. There's my house. Okay, uh, let's just go zoom out. So it's quite smooth as well. Not bad at all. Okay, so I'll close that down. Let's try um, Google Maps in the browser. Put in my postcode. Oops, it's told me my battery is low. I've not charged this at all today and I've been uh, using it all day, so, you know, what does that say about battery life? Okay, so we're in uh, Google Maps, in Chrome. Let's see if I can get rid of this panel. There we go. Um, well, I've already found my house previously, so it's kept that position. But as you can see, you know, it's quite smooth. It's not ultra smooth, but it's not bad. It's workable, especially if you're out and about and you you need a map. You know, it's not got to be absolutely perfect. So I can grab my house. There we go. There's my house. And that's it. Both maps, uh, Google Earth and uh, Google Maps, on the XOPC.